everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Sabrina and I'm back with another Excel tutorial for you. In this tutorial, we're going to be looking at string functions and we're going to be focusing on the first three functions, which is left, right and mid string function. Okay, now these three functions will basically help you to retrieve specific characters from a string of data in Excel. Okay, so if you look at my spreadsheet here, you can see I've got um, a table of data where you can see the full name and next to each name, you can see the person's contact details. But in the contact details, you can see that I've got um, a few information combined into one cell. So for example, um, I've got the area code along with the phone number and also I have the extension number for that person as well, all combined into one cell. But what I want to do is I want to split that information into different columns. Okay, so I've created my extra columns to, at the end. So if you look at column C, okay, I want to basically extract the area code. I then want to um, extract the phone number, which is the middle bit there. Okay, and then I want a column for just their extension numbers, right? So I just want to basically split all of the contact details into three main areas, area code, phone number, and then extension number. Now, I could just manually do that, okay, one by one, um, but if you've got a large data set, that would of course take you a lot of time to do. So the string functions can really help. So let me show you how you would use the string function to extract um, all of the three types of data. So let's look at the area code. Now we know that the area code is basically um, the first information entered into these cells. So this whole data here, okay, if we look at the first person is basically called a string of data. So we want to extract the characters um, on the left of that string. So we will use the left string function. So what you would do is you would start typing the formula. So if I just select the first cell, you would type equal left. Okay, and you can see it's suggested the function to me at the bottom. You would then type open bracket. And then um, at the bottom, you'll see what information this function requires. So it wants me to select the text. Okay, so this is basically um, the string or uh, the string of data that you want to extract uh, the information from. So I want to extract the information from the data in, in this cell here. So I'm just going to select that cell. Okay, so you would select the data or the cell where you want to extract the information from. Okay, you would then enter a comma and then the next bit of information it requires is number of characters. So here you need to specify the number of characters. How many characters do you want to extract from that um, particular string of data? So if I count the number of characters, okay, so that's includes the open bracket there. So that's one, two, three, four, five characters. Okay, so I'm going to put a number five in there, like so. And then you would close your bracket to complete the function. And then I'm going to press the enter key on my keyboard. And there you go. Okay, so it's extracted the area code for me. All right, and returned five characters from the left of that string. Okay, and now for the rest of the people on that list, um, just like always, I can copy and drag the formula down. Um, so what you would do is to copy and drag, you can select the cell with the function in and then hover your mouse over the fill handle, which is basically a small green square in the bottom right hand corner of your selected cell. And if you hover your mouse over that fill handle, you'll see a black cross and you can either just um, hold, hold and drag your mouse down okay into the rest of the cells or you can just double click into that black uh, that black cross so if you double click it will fill in the rest of the cells with the same function okay and 
you will see that the area code will be filled in for you. Okay, so you saw how easy that was to do. Um, now, let's look at the phone number. Okay, now, if you look at the string of data, um, the phone number is basically in the middle, right, of that string. So I'm going to be using um, the mid function. All right, so what you would do is you would select the first cell. You would then type equal mid, M-I-D. Okay, and you can see um, it suggests the function to me at the bottom. And the mid uh, function will basically return the characters from the middle of a text string, okay? Um, so what you would then do is you would type open bracket, and then you can see at the bottom next to the function what kind of information I need to enter in. So the first thing is I need to select the text string, so the cell which has the text string in it where I want to um, extract the information from. So again, that's this cell here. So I would just select the cell and that would input the cell reference number for me. Okay, you would then type comma. Now what you want to do is you want to um, type in the start number. Okay, so the start number is basically um, the number of character where you want to um, start the extraction from. So here, if we count the number of characters from the beginning, um, so that's one, two, three, four, five. Okay, and remember the space is also a character, is also included, so that's six. Okay, and then seven. So um, my middle or my phone number starts from number seven. Okay, so that's character number seven. So you would enter number seven in there. So you're telling it to start from um, character number seven. Okay, you would then put a comma in and then you want to specify the number of characters. So how many characters does it need to extract from that text string? So again, you need to count the number of characters. So that would be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight characters, okay? So you would put in the function number eight, and then you would you, uh, you would close your brackets to end the function, or rather to complete the function, and then you would um, hit the enter key on your keyboard. And there you go. Okay, so that's now returned the um, the middle section of that text string, which is basically the phone number. So it started from the seventh character from that text string, okay, and it's returned um, eight characters, okay. So that's the middle. Now again, I'm going to just copy and drag that formula down. So I'm just going to select the first cell, go over to my fill handle. When I see the black cross, I'm just going to double click into that black cross and that would copy down the formula for me into the rest of the cells and input the rest of the phone numbers. Okay, right, so that's the mid string text function. Um, now the next one is the extension number. Now, if you go back to this text string here, the extension number is basically um, right at the end. So it's towards the right of that text string. So we'll be using the right uh, string function here. So what you would do is you would type equal and then write. And as you can see, it suggested the right function to you at the bottom. You would then you would then type open bracket. And again, you'll see the information it requires for this function. So the first piece of information is the text string. So it's the cell which has the text string in it. Um, from where you want to extract the information from. So you would just select the, the cell with the text string in it, like so. Okay, and that would input the reference, the cell reference number. You would then type comma, and then you want to specify the number of characters it needs to extract from that text string. So again, you need to go back to your text string and count the number of characters it needs to extract. So that would be one, two, three, four. Again, space is also a character, so five, six, seven, eight. So that's eight characters. So you would put a number eight 
in the function. Close your bracket because that completes the function, that completes the formula. And then press enter on your keyboard again. And there you go. So we now have the extension number. Okay. So again, just select the first cell, go over to your fill handle. Okay. Until you see a black cross and then double click to copy and drag the formula down into the rest of the cells. Right. So that was it. Um, that's how you use the left middle and the right string functions to extract um, pieces of text from a long text string. Okay. Um, now, I hope that's not been too confusing and that's been helpful. If it has been useful, then please do like and share the video so that it can reach out to more people. And do consider subscribing so that you don't miss out on any new videos. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching as always. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Bye-bye.